Well, I'm out for a few chugs tonight. Uh, I don't know if you can hear us, but the wind's a bit wild. I've just had that one there, I'd say four and a half, five pounds. So the, it must be feeding hard. And I've just caught it in the lip there. Perfect. Well, not what we're after, but uh, I've just had that coolie there. I'd probably say it was about 37 centimetres. Not massive, but keeps you ticking over. Like I've said before, uh, if you can't hear us, it's because the wind, it's about 40 mile an hour wind or something, easterly, straight into my face. So when I've cast it in, I'm just having to hold the rod and turn away. But I was hoping for something better than that. Coley, I know that. Mind you, I did have one about four and a half, five pounds. But I'll get that pub back and uh, send another bait out. I think I'm going to move Mark actually once I've put the Coley back. Uh, just it's emptying out a little bit too much now. But I'll let you know if I get anything else. Well, that's me just back in the car there. Tonight was just a quick session. Um, I wasn't planning on coming out at all. One, because I thought the winds would have been too strong. And two, it was my daughter's birthday party. So I didn't think I'd get time after that. But I've managed to come out and I've had three chucks. I've had one cod, four and a half pound, and I've had a coolie about 37 centimetres, maybe a little bit more. Um, so not too bad, really. Two fish from three casts. Um, also, they'll either be a little, there's a few clips I was out fishing with Keith from Morecambe. Um, when was it? I think it was last Friday. Um, so I'll stick that the few clips that I've got of that one into this video just because it was too windy last week and stuff, so we just called it a night early and we didn't uh, have enough casts really to even make a video. But there's a lovely surprise if you keep watching there's a cracking fish that gets pulled in and it wasn't me <laughs> I didn't um, get a bite but Keith managed to pull a cracker in but I'll not spoil it too much but if you could give us a like and subscribe that would be great um, probably the next couple of weeks I'm hoping to um, get a proper session in and get it videoed properly but I've just been busy um, either with my daughter or fishing the club match and when you fish the club match you just haven't got time to video so I'll get a proper one done but until the next time thank you for watching and also actually we're only 27 off of a thousand which I can't believe to be honest when I first started the channel I thought probably get about 20 followers and I'm not even exaggerating I honestly thought nothing would come of it um, but all I can say is thank you very much for all your support uh, it means a lot just makes you want to uh, do the videos more to be honest 
But until the next time, tight lines. Hello and welcome to the Cod Hunter. Tonight I've got Keith up from Morecambe. Um, I think I've killed them off on the walk leg, but I've told them it'll be worthwhile. Um, we're just about to have our first cast out there now. It's too windy to have a stand. So if we get any fish, all we will be doing is just videoing the fish on the floor because it's just way too windy to leave the rods and stuff. Keith, do you want to say a couple of words? Yeah, I've had to have uh, three stops on the way here. It's virtually crippled me, but hopefully it'll be a good do. And thanks for inviting me, George. Aye, no problem, Keith, any time. Well, that's our first cast we've just had there. Keith's just brought in a monster. Must be about eight and a half pounds. I think it could be more. The only thing is, it's just shy on the belly it's got a head like a pit bull um, to be honest I had to give Keith a couple of stern words to keep on reeling in because uh, I think the poor man would have had a broken back if not um, but what a fish because he's travelled for three hours to come up here fishing so I'm just glad he's been rewarded, do you know what I mean? Keep doing to get a hold of that and uh, I'll just show everybody. As you can see, the fish there. Keith is buzzing, on you? I am buzzing, that's the pretty best, sir. That's his personal best. It's an absolute monster. Thank you, George. Um, Right, like I say, Keith, no problem at all. Um, that was caught on squid and worm. Black lug, wasn't it? Uh, it's an absolute bella. But we're going to get the rods put back in. So if anything else happens, we'll get back to you. 